Dude, when I was doing the intro of Florence, I like, what the, I like slammed the table and the camera went straight up in the air. <laughs> All right, so I won't hit the table. Something's never changed. I'll just always be shit at intros. It's hard getting it all, getting yeah. it started. So today we're at Southern National Motorsports Park for the biggest payout in the history of late model racing. To win this race is going to get us $50,000. And we ran really well here last year. So we are going to be doing this video a little bit differently. This is part one of two and part one is going to be taking place today and tomorrow and then part two is going to be its own thing that's going to be the full entire 250 lap race so when it comes to today we're already behind schedule it rained pretty much all night so they're drying the track we ditched a round of practice and we're about to pick up two more and then we're done for the day this is the one thing i don't like about the show we left on thanksgiving to come run three rounds of practice and then we're done for the day as always we'll be taking you all along with us and uh, i appreciate all the support on the most recent videos just about 79 percent of y'all are not subscribed and we've been getting a lot of views lately so if just a few more percent of you click the subscribe button, it really helped me out a lot. If you've been following along with us all season, you know that we have lost a race in just about every possible way. We've been wrecked for the win. We've been wrecked by a lap car. I've lost my brakes. I've choked some races away. Had a back off in the race tower. Anything you can think of has happened to us this year. So it'd be really cool if we could go out there and go get a nice payday to end out the year. But with that being said, we're about to get into practice right now and we will take you all along with us. One practice session left and we've been pretty good so far we really haven't put down like a, a fast fast time I'm satisfied with the speed we have so far with the amount of laps we have on the tires we're about to do a mock run right now and then we might do another one again tomorrow and it kind of seems like a waste of tires but I'm just not confident in qualifying here because I don't have that much experience like I do everywhere else that we race so we're about to do that this should be it for the day and then we'll see what else we can film but we still got we gotta go win practice like I said at Florence so hopefully we can go do that again It's almost 7.30 in the morning right now, and we are about to go to the track. We didn't really do an outro yesterday, so I'm kind of combining it with the intro today. We did wind up having the fastest lap in yesterday's final practice. Doesn't really mean much, because we won practice at Florence and we didn't win the race, so we need to find a way to make these practice wins to turn in the race wins. But we're not going to be setting the world on fire today when it comes to practice. We're uh, going to be working on our race trim mostly. So we only have one hour long session, and then we qualify. So it'll be an early day for us after we get done qualifying. Uh, I'm really hoping that we don't have to fight the rain all day tomorrow. It does not look good right now. I don't know what we're going to do if we're going to have to end up racing on Monday or Sunday night or something like that. But either way, it doesn't really matter in terms of the video because everything will be condensed down. Hopefully we can go out there and maybe go get a pole today and uh, we'll have some momentum heading into tomorrow. So practice 
been done for a while and now we're just sitting around waiting for qualifying to start. Now in practice we knew we weren't going to be setting the world on fire when it came to that hot lap just because we did our mock run at the end of yesterday's practice and we just really focused on our race run and we showed some really good speed. So I want to say we were like 24th or something like that in practice but I'm not worried about it. We did have a pretty close call with Mike Looney though. He spun out and I actually locked it up. Thankfully I was able to drive it down the hill and not run into him. That would have sucked for us both. But I pulled a low number which means that I'm going to be one of the first cars to go out for late model qualifying. Kind of like Florence, I think the time I ran yesterday is not going to be good enough. I'm going to need to pick it up a tenth or two, but I think we're more than capable of a top five. I'm really satisfied with how everything's been going so far this weekend, so I just want to qualify well. That way we can carry some confidence into tomorrow's race. We've been on a bit of a hot streak too when it comes to qualifying, so hopefully we can keep that up here. So I'm going to chill out for probably the next half hour, and then we're going to jump into it. Do the impossible Cause this is what I'm So we're about to get out of here. We qualified 15th, which is not what we wanted. I don't know, I'd put the blame on myself. I think I kind of overdrove the corner and then I just washed up the racetrack, screwed myself. But you know, 15th is less than a 10th off of the pole. We just happened to be on the back half of that uh, good 10th. You know, it sucks starting 15th. Uh, we've got a good race car. I'm really satisfied with how practice went today in our race run. And you know, we've been on a good streak when it comes to qualifying. So I had to kind of break at some point. I think we might've started worse here last year and we finished third. With that being said, we are gonna wrap up this video and we're gonna pick up tomorrow with a new video and uh, hopefully we pick up tomorrow there's like a 90% chance of rain all day so I'm not sure what the call is with that but if you like the video be sure to give it a thumbs up it helps push it out there to more people and we've been doing really good on the views lately so I'd appreciate it and now also subscribe to stay up to date like I said 79% of y'all are not subbed so if we could just get like five or 10% of y'all it would just it would be a feel-good number you know kind of like our mock run was <laughs> just a feel-good number we are gonna cut this video here and we're gonna pick up tomorrow morning but yeah so we'll see you guys then into whatever song I used to edit this video I'm <laughs> <laughs>